Hey guys. Um, got uh, something new here that we're going to be doing in the shop here. Um, uh, I'm going to be putting some new lights in. Um, these are LED lights. Um, these are four foots. Um, I actually got these from watching One Lonely Farmer. Uh, Peterson's Quality Lighting. Um, this is what model they are, the T8, T8 LED. Um, so, yeah, watched uh, One Lonely Farmer and I seen these lights and uh, I went to their website and uh, I was quite surprised on how much uh, they actually cost. Um, I believe these ones here are 30 bucks each. Um, and I actually ended up paying like 28.50 with a discount. Um, but uh, I got two of them here. I got one here and then I got another one in the house I have to go get yet. Um, but uh, me and my dad just thought we were going to get two of them and see the difference and see how much more light they give off. Um, these are the single singles. Um, these ain't the doubles. Um, I didn't do the doubles because I was reading uh, and it said uh, for ceilings that are 10 feet and below um, it wouldn't do as the light wouldn't be out uh, uh, I'll put it this way. I, I believe these do 180 degree 180 degree lighting and the uh, doubles are like 160 um, don't quote me on it but uh, I believe it's something like that so I the ceilings in here are maybe a hair over 10 feet but uh, I figured the single ones I think will do the job um, and the way we're gonna do it I think we'll have plenty of white lighting um, but I got that one I removed that one and I put it up here and that one there don't work anymore and then if you can see that one doesn't work anymore and then I the one that was here there that um, that one didn't work either anymore so I just moved that one and we're gonna put two right there and then I think we're gonna order another another three to finish this side we're gonna actually put one take that one and move it back and that one back there move it back um, and I'm just moving them back as long as they work I'll put them back here cuz uh, I'm not we're just gonna be ordering some every month and then eventually we'll have them all um, but uh, what I plan on doing I'm hoping is uh, when I put one here I'd like to run one underneath this door so when the door is closed we have light here now I haven't uh, figured out how I'm gonna do it yet, but I got a good idea how. But um, uh, that's what we plan on doing, anyways. Um, I believe there's a two by four. There's two by. Uh, I don't know if you can see it or not. Well, uh, you can see right there. There's two by fours that run uh, across, and there's one that goes this way. And I'm thinking about putting one right there, because on these lights. They have um, the adapter, like this one. This is where. Oh, let me zoom this baby back out. There we go. And these lights here, um, they got the adapters on the other side, so you can plug in. I think these go up to five. Five. Five of these can plug into one outlet. Um, this. This is the, what the plugins look like, and I was looking, and you can buy different lengths of cord. So the ones they give you, I can't. They're only a couple, couple inches or whatever uh, long, and uh, then you can just, you know plug it into this one here, and then plug it to the next one, and then go down with the next light bar. Um, but uh, they sell different lengths in between the lights. Um, I think there's a two foot, a four foot, or a four foot, a six foot, and a ten foot. I think it's a four foot, six foot, ten foot. So 
um, that's kind of nice to have so we'll be doing that um, I didn't order the uh, ends for these so I ended up went and bought some plugins um, they these ones here are actually made to be hardwired straight in um, I just put the ends on it so I can plug it in um, not a big deal so the plant so yeah um, we're gonna hang these up there and it's pretty simple um, to hang these um, uh, here's the mounting brackets all it is is a screw and then there's a clip and uh, I thought the clips would uh, be a little uh, chintzy but I put one on and they actually grab really good um, I thought they you know they'd fall but uh, no they actually they actually do stick I mean uh, they do clamp onto the light so I ain't worried about them falling but so yeah so that's kind of like the plan here and then far as back here uh, the lighting really sucks back here so what we plan on doing is especially over my skid steer I'm actually when I put one here, I'm actually gonna run one over there as well. So that way I can plug one in so there'll be three in this row, then three in that row back there, because I got one there, and then that one's burnt out. That one's actually just garbage. The ballasts are just bad in them, that's what it is. So I'm gonna put one there, and then I'm gonna run another one down and put one there. And then back behind the 1586, we'll put another row. And then in the back, I'll put probably another row too. So, I think in all I'll need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 16 of these total. Uh, yeah, 16 total. I got two, so I need 14 more yet um, to complete this. Uh, complete this. Uh, the lighting in the shed so um, I'm gonna put these up and uh, we'll compare them to these and uh, we'll see how much more lighting they give off and um, I told the Petersons I can't think of their names right now um, that I would do a review on them now nah, they weren't asking me to but I just assume to do it do it and uh, and uh, Show you what the doubles are. I know one lonely farmer had the uh, had the doubles. Um, I got the singles, so we'll go from there. So stay tuned because the next video will be uh, comparing the lights. So thanks for watching, guys.